Hi, everyone. Bill Fairman and my lovely sister and business partner, Wendy Sweet, oh, along awesome. with our dear friend, So Hill. <laughs> um, by the way, before we get started, I want to please ask you to share and to subscribe and to, what's the other one, thumbs up and yeah. uh, like and follow uh, and subscribe. chase and snap a chat and no, 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 the wrong one <laughs> our url for those of you who don't know what url is our web address is yeah carolinahardmoney.com for any additional information anyway <laughs> so hill was uh, so kind as to join yeah. us i think so hill you have borrowed and you have been a lender have you not yes you played both That's sides awesome. of the fence so Awesome. Give us a little bit of a uh, your background on how you even got started in real estate investing in the first place. Well, my background goes back. So I'm originally from India. Came here in '94 uh, for my parents. Moved to Charlotte. Uh, how old were you? I was probably what, man, eight or nine. You were a little chap. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. So I'm a native to Charlotte, so I wasn't born here, but yeah, definitely. we claim that too. Yeah. I'm, I've been here for most of my life. Grew up in the Charlotte area, and I have a corporate background in sales and marketing for AT&T Wireless for probably over 10 years. Started very young. Wow. At the age of 18. Wow. Yeah, I had to support my family. Parents got laid off, and they used to work for a really good company called Selectron Technology. Wow. They got bought out, got sold out, so that's a corporate life for you. Yeah. Right? Sure. Uh, you're oh, younger, yeah. and you're kind of on their terms. Mm-hmm. So I had to step in to take care of my family at that point, and I learned a lot in the corporate world, which I still use in today's Absolutely. life to help me invest and do do what I do. Awesome. Yeah. Listen, awesome. There, there are great lessons in the corporate world. One of them really is the EOS system it's called, contraction, it's called right? The entrepreneur's operating system, mm -hmm. and although it's really designed for large businesses, a lot of small businesses uh, really need to use it properly. And uh, I mean that's that's where that structure came out of mm -hmm. in the first place. Yeah, so we'll give them that credit. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. And they're a little harder to deal with on yeah. a regular basis, though. Definitely. They are more numbers oriented. So tell me about your latest project. What are you working on now? Well, I got one. Fix and flip cash out refinance or the Burr method, I guess. Right. Which everyone is kind of right. It's the hot, hot new name, I guess, yes. for things. Yes. Burr. Burr. It's so cold. <laughs> that it's, it's, it's great. That's actually part of the sport coat that I have. It's the Burr cloth. Yeah. Burr cloth. <laughs> so well, they didn't give me the cash out though. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> So that's one I got going on. It's in Gastonia. You guys have been so wonderful to help. Awesome. Me. We did the uh, loan on that with one. The, with the funding. So let me ask you the question. Yeah. Here's a guy who can finance all his own stuff. Yes. You're lending yes. money yourself. Why in the world would you borrow it? What What are you thinking? Well, <laughs> my philosophy, and I think I, I don't want to speak for anybody else, but I want to have enough capital to do more. And every investment takes a part of me, which is the down payment, right, to put the skin in the game, mm -hmm. right? And that shows my commitment level of how serious I am to borrowing money mm -hmm. and you guys trusting into me to make sure I succeed because you guys underwrite the deal as well. Right. And you guys kind of have my back on that too. So, I, so yeah. Awesome. Awesome. So in lend, how do you like the lending side? Tell me, tell me about that. What do uh, you think of that? How do I personally like the mm -hmm. lending side? So the lending mm -hmm. side gives me opportunities where what I find in the in the community, there's deals out there, but people like mm -hmm. they lack like money and they lack like capital. So I kind of come in sometimes. I do help with bringing some cash to the table. Um, do joint ventures with people. Mm -hmm. um, kind of help them on that end. Helps me, helps them, um, and I could kind of help them along the way and guide them with the information that I know today. Right. Uh, I don't know everything, but what I do know, I could make sure that I could help and, and assist them. That, and I think that's a that's a really important part about lending is, you know, we certainly don't know everything. Although sometimes I feel like I've made every mistake that could possibly be made. Yeah. But I know that's not true because there's more that you can always make. <laughs> the goal is to make as, as, as them as cheaply as you possibly can. Right. And you want to learn from other people's mistakes. But yeah. I think one of the things that sets you apart and sets us apart from other people who are lending and other companies who are lending is the fact that 
you know, we want to take them under our wing. We want to show them, hey, don't step in that. Yeah. You know, do it this way. Here's how it worked out the last time we saw these things happen. Yes. So you might want to look in this direction and it makes a big difference for the person that's borrowing the money. What's been a huge, I guess, a godsend, right? That I found you guys, you guys are local. And being local, investing into a local market here is huge. Yeah. I don't depend on larger corporations from national hard money lenders because they don't know the market. Right. And at that point, you become a number. That's exactly right. So I know that I could depend on you guys to help me succeed. And if I'm succeeding, you're succeeding. Awesome. So, yeah, awesome. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we feel the same way, and we, yeah. we appreciate you saying that. And there are plenty of good national lenders out yes. there that will give you great rates and a good deal and will be attentive to what you want them to do. I think one thing that's pretty common among most of them is they have to use a national appraisal company. Those national appraisal companies don't always choose people who are from the area to do the appraisal, or they might just do a BPO, a broker's price opinion, or a desktop appraisal and not really know the true value, which will keep you from getting the amount of money that you really want to get because you want to have true values on what you're doing. You don't know how long it's going to take them to inspect the property and get money in your account when you're trying to get your draws. That can always be a problem, that's, too. That's a whole other topic yeah. I think we could talk about. And I'll tell you what, your process happened. It's really good. Awesome. Uh, Thank so you. It definitely makes... So we have the stress life when we're doing the projects, right? right. We're managing people, managing money. And I think the draws with, 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 your, with your company has been amazing. Awesome. Uh, so that's a... That's, that's huge. Awesome. Thank that's you. Huge. Thank uh, you. Now, no. you're working, you're helping other people to find lenders as well, right? Correct. So not only are you a lender, but you're helping to broker some deals too. Correct. So as somebody that's a broker, how are you, how, how are you turning these people on to other lenders? Because I know there's several out there that you can use private lenders, you know, there just are. people you know that happen yeah. to have $70,000 in their self-directed IRA or whatever it is, right. how are you able to, you know, figure out who you should send them to? Well, so one thing that I've always focused on is how do I streamline my process and try to collect more information about that individual. Mm -hmm. So on my website, www.fundmywealth.com, you could definitely fill out a request form and I'll review the deal. If I'm interested in the deal, I'll definitely reach out to them, but if not, I will be, you know, reaching out to companies that I've personally dealt with, such as Carolina Hard Money and a couple other ones. Right. That I have a good history and a relationship with that I could trust them to right. make sure they, they do help the individual. Right. Yeah. And it is different. I, yeah. I know houses have different personalities, yes. you know, what kind of financing would work for them. And I think, you know, people do too with, you know, what they're doing. I'm, mm -hmm. You were kind enough to refer one today. And it's funny because it got referred to me from somebody else too. Right. <laughs> Yeah. So, but you were first, <laughs> so I appreciate that. But it, it was a great borrower. Yes. The scores were a little lower than right. what we would normally do. But, right. you know, then we think, well, what else does he have that we can look at? He's so, got serious experience behind him. He's got money in the bank. Yeah. You know, there are, there's different ways that you can judge somebody. Right. But, and unfortunately for all of us, he found another person right. to do his deal. It's right. unfortunate for us. Great for him. He right. found what he needed. And right. it was just a private couple that he had met a couple weeks previous. So it's right. just a great example that there's money out there. There is. And, and you shouldn't have just one. No. You need to have a variety of, right. of people to, yes. to go to. Definitely. That's the only way you can scale. Right. Uh, because, you know, private individuals aren't going to have infinitely deep pockets. I talk about this all the time. Mm -hmm. You always have to have a couple of hard money lenders in your yes quiver, I guess, of ammunition to go after. And at the same time, what I love about you being a lender and a borrower is that right now the biggest issue we have is finding inventory. So you, you get a house, you do a fix and flip or a buy and hold. When that transaction is finished, what do you do next? If you didn't have the lending that you could be doing, you might go out and, and find a deal that isn't exactly the right deal, but you're doing it anyway because you need the transaction. Right. This way you can transition over to something so your money isn't lazy until you do find the right deal right. You know, that comes along. So right. that, that's extremely helpful there. Right. Um, so uh, bravo to what you're doing. Thank you. You know, the other thing I like, I like about you is that you know 
a lot about a lot of different things. I'm always shocked that, we, you know, we before we started rolling the cameras, we were talking about social media and marketing and, and what we're putting things out on. And, and I thought, well, I need Sohill in on this meeting because I know you know a lot about it. So I love getting your input on that. And then, you know, you're in the event world, putting yes. on events, it, a rather large company that does that. Yes. So that's pretty interesting. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah. So I own a company called SS Event Services and Party Rentals, uh, our family-owned, family-ran business. We do mainly wedding, corporate events as well. I think we had one here for you. Uh, yeah. We had a great luncheon. Yeah. yeah. I think. It that was, was awesome. awesome. It was, yeah. So we've been doing that for probably about, what, 13 years now. Love it. I do it with a passion. I love seeing the end result when a couple gets married and it is their next chapter in life. Yeah. And it's a lot of challenges. It's not always, you know, roses That's and right. love. And, <laughs> you know, it's, it's continuous growth for, for, that, and for, the, for that couple. That's and right. I do reach out to my couples after a year and make, you know. Do you really? I That's do. neat. Because it's, you know. You're trying to make sure you can get them for their next wedding. <laughs> <laughs> that. Or, you know, and just to make sure that you're doing well. Uh, Billy sorry. always looks on the bright side. Yeah, yeah it's nothing wrong with that. You, know, you got to get those like referrals anyway. Right. Hey, do you have a friend or are you going through a divorce? Yeah. <laughs> if you need me, let me know. That's um, awesome. But, that's awesome. The other thing, too, is you've done a lot of volunteering for our local real estate investor association, and you just always are such a giving person. You're always just willing to help other people, and I, and I appreciate that about you. I, I'm grateful that I'm one of those people that you help. <laughs> It's awesome to to you know have you as a friend, as a borrower, and as a lender. Thank we're just so we're glad you're in our life thank for sure. You. You, can you think of anything else we want to? I have a hard time thinking. You know that that I know that. <laughs> Usually, all I can oh. come up with smart alley comments. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, I'm good. I just I appreciate that you took the time to yeah, come yeah. come talk to us. Anytime we can utilize other people's experiences to help educate yeah. others. It's a good thing. For sure. For yeah. sure. Thank you so much. We Thank really appreciate it. Me. Thank you so much. It's been awesome. Pleasure. Pleasure. You know, we love you. Yeah. Thanks. All right. Now, next show. I don't know when it is, but it'll be soon. <laughs> don't forget <laughs> to, again, share, subscribe, Follow. like, and thumbs up. Uh, yeah, thumbs up. I don't know what platform that is, but I think it's, it's one of them. Yeah, one of them. So, um, <laughs> CarolinaHardMoney.com if you need any further information. And we do have archived episodes either to the right or to the left or somewhere on the know. screen. So, somewhere, depending on the platform that yeah. you're watching us on. So, anyway, till the next time. Thank take you. Care. Thank you so much for joining us. If you really like what you heard, you want to see some more, switch over here or <laughs> here or perhaps there. There's more episodes, but they're somewhere. Yeah. I think Click they're, it on. They're up. By the way, subscribe and like us as well. Please. <laughs>